Awoni baba nfe o awoni Awoni baba nfe o awoni Awon to ko ile won sori apata Jesu Awoni baba nfe o awoni Awoni baba nfe o awoni The power of anointing in the Christian faith is often associated with the act of consecrating someone or something with holy oil as a symbol of God's blessing and empowerment. This practice is rooted in the biblical tradition, where anointing was used to set apart priests, prophets, and kings for their divine roles. In the context of evangelism, the power of anointing is believed to Equip believers with the spiritual authority and boldness to share the message of salvation. It is believed that through the anointing of the Holy Spirit, Christians are able to effectively communicate the gospel and attract others to the faith. The power of anointing is not limited to evangelism. It is also seen as a source of healing, deliverance, and spiritual renewal. The anointing oil is often used in prayer for the sick, the oppressed, and those in need of spiritual breakthrough. Ultimately, the power of anointing is rooted in the belief that it is God who works through the anointed, empowering them to carry out his purposes on earth. It is a reminder that the source of true power and authority comes from God alone, and that through his anointing, believers can have confidence in their role as ambassadors of the gospel. That is your barrier, 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 that is
from village they will send for you. In Russia, they will know. A good servant. And you are. And see you are. He said, you know, I'm sorry. So I am. And you are looking for a shepherd. You know, you know. You know, you know. It is the secret of God. Oh, everything that we chase, oh, we don't need to chase anymore. Oh, 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 oh. 